A major form of transportation, but now many of them are gone. Yeah, the city of Fort Collins has been doing their part in keeping history alive by keeping Bernie the streetcar in business, though. Dan DeRue has that story from northern Colorado. There's just something about the sights, sounds, and feel of riding a trolley that takes one back. Even if you've never been. The experience is uh, going back in time. It's going back, it's feeling, as you can tell, the motion of the cars, seeing people wave. Everybody loves the trolley. All aboard. Car 21. It was built in 1919, retired in 1951, and then restored in 1984. Initially, they were just going to paint the car. She still runs today by dedicated volunteers like motorman Bethany O'Brien. The best job on the trolley. You have to have a uh, delicate touch. It's definitely more of a art um, than a muscle thing. You have to have awareness of what's ahead of you and behind you on the street. The entire line nowadays is about a mile and a half long on original tracks. 100 year old tracks, pretty cool. On Mountain Avenue. Step out of the trolley. When car 21 is at the end of the line. We're gonna put this pole up. It doesn't turn around. And then we go to the other end and take that pole down. But the seats do. So you just flip them, go right ahead. You can help me out, I'd sure appreciate it. Keep going, we need them all flipped. To be part of the history and to be able to share this with people just thrills me a bunch. Hi. So I was fascinated by it. I'm actually a veterinarian, so a very different field. And um, I wanted to learn how to drive the car. Nowadays, most folks will tell you, car 21 doesn't really take you anywhere. We disagree. Dan DeRue, Fox 31. So, so cool there for Fort Collins. Our thanks to Dan.